Now I'm often asked, how come Polyfilter can remove the bad stuff and not remove the good stuff? And the um, answer is that this is a very complex chemical material and embedded in the material itself is certain amounts of trace elements and desirable um, um, things that you'll find in the aquarium. So for example, if there is a small amount of iron or um, manganese or, or whatever that they've actually built into this material, then it won't suck that out to that level. Um, that does not mean that you can go tipping iron on this um, polyfilter and it will not remove iron. That's not true. It will actually remove iron, but it will not remove it to the low trace dose that it's actually embedded in. And that goes right across the board with all the different elements that are, are um, desirable in an aquarium. If they are in the aquarium in low dose, the polyfilter will not remove it. If it is in the aquarium in very high dose, then yes, they will actually remove it. Um, and I also get a lot of comments about phosphate. It does help to remove phosphate, but I do not use this media as a phosphate remover. I um, will acknowledge that it removes a little bit, but I won't um, use it in replace of either a ferric iron or a phosphate removing type chemical. Anyway, put a little comment down the bottom with um, your experience.